Welcome to a Sims 4 uh, All Achievements playthrough. Uh, recently, I found a post on Reddit from some user telling, or well, asking if anyone has ever done an All Achievement playthrough. And they said they did research and couldn't find any. So, well, here it is. Um, so, doing some research of my own, I found out that in The Sims 4, there are approximately 51 achievements for the base game. You've got 8 secret achievements that are hidden. Uh, and along with that, we've got the two expansions that I currently own, Get to Work, which has 9 of its own achievements, along with 3 hidden ones, and Cats and Dogs, which honestly might be the easiest achievements to acquire considering they're just gaining simstagram followers which shouldn't be too difficult um, so I guess we'll just get right into it um, here is the sim I have created her name is Layla Simmons and to give myself a bit of an easier time with this I gave her the genius trait just so that she has an easier chance gaining skills and f from her base aspiration nerd brain she gains quick learner trait which also helps her build skills just a tiny bit faster just so this doesn't become like a thousand part series but we'll see what happens in the future uh, I guess the easiest thing to do would be to first f start with a job um, excuse me. Uh, the easiest way to do this, I guess, we'll start with whatever the first job that comes up and max it out. Uh, looks like we're a cop. All right, and 24 hours till work. So let's look through the achievement list. Right. Uh, forgot to mention we started here in the Bennington Boathouse was maybe the best option, although it only starts you, you know, with $600 to Molians. My bad. Uh, let's check out the achievements. Uh, so, uh, Clued In is the first achievement we'll work to, work towards. And we also probably should start with a skill achievement. Uh, looking at this, easiest that might be to get would be to probably start with Green Thumb or any of the collection skills. Alright, let's... Not much space to work with here, not much money to work with here, but let's get a nice little... A nice little plant here in the corner. Uh, probably, probably a fruit, just to start with, and earn us extra money when the time comes. And we really are hoping for grape seeds here. Okay, let let's see what we got here. Perfect. Let's go ahead and plant these. Do these spoil? I don't think they do. Uh, let's stick them in the fridge just for cooking possibilities in the future. Let's go ahead and plant this grape tree. Make sure it's watered. And there we go. We've acquired our first skill, gardening. We could probably Yeah, let's add to our Simstagram story. Start getting some followers. Yeah, that, that achievement isn't going to take that long to get. What else do we got here? Event Horizon. Earn a silver rating on five different social events. If I recall correctly, the Welcome Wagon should be coming soon. 
so we could we could do that or we could travel to the club and start practicing piano I think getting the piano skill might be our next best option so let's go ahead and travel over to Club Calico probably the best nightclub in any expansion in my opinion alright here we are at Club Calico and first thing we do let's start practicing the piano There's a lady in a towel. Oh, nope, that's a dress. Looks like a towel. But hey, at least we're getting some money. Even though it's two dollars, two simoleons at a time. It, it's some money. Alright. Uh-oh. Apparently embarrassed. Let's go pep ourselves up. All right, just seems all right. And let's go, let's go jogging. Accomplish another whim, just to get some extra points. Ooh, okay. Sh she wants to hug someone. Let's make a friend. Mm hmm. You know what? Everybody's best friends with their bartender. Why not? Let's get her back over here. All right. Nope. She no longer wants to hug someone. All right. Oh, well, let's let's do it anyways. Hug. Is it? Uh, maybe we don't have the action. Let's fire them up. All right. She wants to become energized. Oh, here we go. Chat with someone. Let's discuss interests. Let's learn about this uh, townie. Continue with telling a joke. <laughs> oh, I did not know comedy was a skill. Totally forgot that. Oh, that's a skill we have to level up to then. And our sim needs to use the toilet, so let's go use the bathroom. Oh. How'd she all of a sudden get focused? Oh, just from her trait. All right, our sim is gonna pee her pants. Let's, uh, let's, please go use the bathroom. Why are they canceling their own actions? Layla, I swear. Oh right, forgot one of one of these bathrooms has a weird glitch that you can't access it. Yep, see. I don't know what it is, but something about this bathroom you can't access it. It's quite annoying. Let's practice the piano, get our skill up to two, and then head back home to rest up for our job in the morning. Uh, 
they're giving us money for trying. All right, let's go ahead and head home. Why is this taking so long? All right, back home. Oh, I guess we missed the welcome party. And someone just left the fruit cake on our doorstep. Let's not eat that because I've heard that sometimes eating the fruit cake can seriously mess up your Sam. And yeah, perfect. That is exactly what I was gonna make you ha have her make. Let's get some cooking skill. That might be the hardest to get up. Oh well, no. Not that bad. Alright, she's still pretty pretty up and happy. And of course she used the let's actually I'm gonna feel exhausted here, but let's go ahead and sleep instead of raiding. Alright. I think the easiest achievement in the game is probably uh What's it called? It's like the lone wolf one. It is introvert. Do nothing social for 24 sim hours. It'd be the easiest one and we can probably accomplish it here in the next following day. Although because the job is an active job, we probably won't be able to. Alright, well. She's up and focused. Let's see. She's hungry. Needs to use the bathroom as well. So let's get that done. Take a shower. And then after that, go ahead and cook up some scrambled eggs and bacon. Because it's breakfast after all. Ooh. Got a nice, good little grapevine. And how long till our job starts? Two hours. to do will she make nope she may not be able to all right looks like we're eating at work a little too late darn it was that shower all right let's begin oh man I would get to work for a while now and I've really never done these I've done doctor a few times but I've only gotten to like the third skill level, so this will be an interesting thing. Alright, welcome to the force. It's time to start fighting crime. First things first, use computer to get a case assignment. Now, first things first, we need to visit the break room, which is upstairs. I always forget these places I've been upstairs. Yep. First things first is let's get a meal, because we are hungry as poop. Let's let's eat. Come on, Lily, eat faster. All right, that'll be fine. Let's clean this up and go get a work assignment. Um. Well, we'll have to kick someone off their computer. Good case assignment. Oh, she's washing a plate in the evidence locker sink. Alright, well, no one's here, so let's, let's go over to this one then. Oh, no, wait. She, she, she kicked off the receptionist, who is also in a cop uniform for some reason. I think that might be a little illegal. Assist with the crime scene investigation. You need to learn the ropes before you can handle running your own case. You'll start by assisting veteran detective with the crime scene investigation. Use a crime map to travel to the crime scene. Let's go ahead and travel to the crime scene. Ooh, listen to that music. At a crime scene, you'll find you can find clues that will help you track down a suspect. Investigate damaged or stolen objects and search for clues on the ground nearby to uncover more evidence. Also, talk with witnesses to get a report about what happened. All right, so here we are at the crime scene. 
So we need to get a report from a witness, collect some clues, and take pictures. So, why is Alice came at this house? Wait, where's the... Oh, there she is. She's outside. Go ahead and take a witness report. Oh, come on, game. Take witness report. Alright, a witness report has been added to your inventory. Provide an account of what they saw. Let's go ahead and start searching for clues then. So, how do we do this? Just go and keep hitting search for clues. There are a lot of cops here. Oh, yeah, there's a clue. Let's take a picture. And take an evidence. Sweet. Alright. Let's check the dining room. No, but we do have another burn spot. Is someone burn in this house? Alright. Don't go reading in someone else's house when you're trying to investigate. Ooh, there we go, there's a sample. Click the evidence sample. Alright, let's see if there's anything here on the back porch. Nope, nothing on the back porch. Oh man. Um, let's check the bathroom then. Can't find any evidence. This is not good. Oh, they've got a second bathroom over here, so let's search here. Oh, how about the balcony? She's super focused, but. can't find any clues. There's one last balcony to check. Uh-oh. We may have failed this work day. Oh, I thought I collected this evidence sample. Let's collect it again. Oh, that's weird. Um, there's this empty area here. Well, we were definitely underperforming our jobs. Oh, there's a clue. As soon as the day ends. Wish it could work overtime. That was not very good of a job. Alright, well, we're back home, and I th think after the first day on the job, that's a good place to stop this first episode. So, I guess, until next time. See ya.